الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أحبت في الله We live in a time of great controversy and turmoil. And in which we see ikhtilaf in kathira. We see many, many differences. How many countless occasions have we seen and will we continue to see? So this should help to alleviate the confusion that we see fitna and trust me, you will see plenty of fitna after this time. And the Prophet ﷺ said, "Asmi wa ta'a." Or the Prophet ﷺ said, "Asma wa ta'a." Hear and obey the leader. When Abd al-Habashian, even if he was an Ethiopian slave, for in and then the Prophet ﷺ said, Those, barely those who live after me, will see many differences. As we see now. And then he ﷺ said, So it's upon you my sunnah and the sunnah of the rightly guided Khalifat. Abu Bakr, Umar, Uthman, and Ali, radiyallahu ta'ala anhum, ajma'een. So, from fiqh fi deen is learning how to deal with those differences. Learning how to deal with differences, especially between Ahl sunnah To know the qawaid in principles and the usul. To what, that way you can distinguish between mukhalafata Ahl sunnah and mukhalafata Ahl bid'ah. That's absolutely imperative imperative for the believer to be able to make those dis to, to, to be able to distinguish that fitna because the prophet said فَعَلَيْكَمْ بِي سُنَّتِي وَسُنَّةَ الْخُلَفَ الرَّاشِدِينَ الْمَحْدِينَ It's upon you my sunnah and the sunnah of the rightly guided khalifat so that means that requires ilm wa fiqh and requires ilm wa fiqh knowledge and wisdom on how to understand and apply those principles. So it's knowing those principles, it's knowing the usul, and it's knowing how to apply those principles. So that way you can distinguish between Ahlul Sunnah wa Ahlul Bid'ah. And that you can distinguish between or how to deal with Ahlul Sunnah. These are some of the primary usul that we need to understand and busy ourselves with as mubtadiyin, meaning as beginners, as beginners in the religion, we need to know and understand these things. Otherwise, every time the wind blows and there's a new fitna, and they're speaking about this one, and there's new cut and paste videos about this one, and there's new attacks upon this one, you have to be able to distinguish between haq and batil, and that only comes with ilm. Because as we're promised, as a part of prophecy, you're going to see many differences. So learning how to deal with those differences and learning that between Ahl Sunnah, when there's those differences, that there's an adab, there's manners, and there's ways to maintain the brotherhood even with differences. Differences do not have to make you enemies. Differences do not have to make you enemies. Enemies, and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Sallallahu alaihi wasallam, ala Nabi Muhammad wa ala alihi wasallam.